Hi, this is Sharon from SC Statistical Programming. In this video, I'm going to show you how to upload uh, the data files and SAS programs from my courses. So those two uh, zip files I downloaded uh, from my course material, um, one is for uh, data and one is for the SAS codes for SAS-based certification course. So I'm only using that course as an example. Okay, so we want to upload all the data files and the SAS programs uh, into SAS on demand in order to use it in uh, SAS on demand. Okay, so I click on the first one, which is um, the SAS code zip file. So I right click and then um, I just uh, choose extract all. So it asked me to choose a destination and extract files. So automatically it will create a folder with the same name as my zip file. So that is fine for me. I just click on extract. So this is the extract folder. Um, yeah, this one. And then let me uh, perform the same task for data. So just right click and then uh, go to extract all. And here um, all the files to be extracted will be in this folder uh, with the same name as the original zip file. So I just click on extract. So it has 155 items. Okay, so now uh, I have two uh, extracted folder. So in the data here, it's all the files uh, in the data zip file. Now it's no, they have been extracted. And then for the SAS code, uh, it has all the SAS code files uh, already been extracted in this folder. Okay. So I already log in the SAS on demand. So this is the SAS on demand. So I want to upload all the files from um, data zip folder into this files home, which is my uh, home directory. Okay, so I click on this and then here, this is the upload uh, icon. Click on upload and uh, the files will be uploaded to home slash c dot sharing x. This is the direction of my home drive. So this c dot sharing x is the part before at of my Gmail address, which is my login. Uh, email address for SAS on demand. So you will need to change this to your information. Okay. So I click on choose files and then I click on this um, data. So I want to upload everything uh, in this folder uh, to SAS on demand. So I just click on this and then shift and then click on open. So now it has everything, uh, all the files in here. So I just click on upload. Okay, so you can see under this files home, this home directory in SAS on demand, I have uploaded all the files in the data zip folder. Okay, in order to be organized because um, I have other courses, so I don't want the program to mix together. So I want to uh, create a folder that only hold the SAS codes from my SAS base certification course. So what I do is I click on files home and then I uh, create a folder under it. So I call this folder as um, SAS base code. So um, all the SAS programs uh, from this course will be uh, uploaded to this folder. Okay. So this is a subfolder of this uh, home drive. Now you can see here, there's a new folder here, SAS base code. And right now it's empty. Okay. So I just click on it and then uh, click on the upload uh, icon. So we can see the file will be uploaded to the home drive and then uh, the subfolder we just created, which is SAS base codes. Okay, so choose files. 
and then we go to the downloads and this is the SAS code folder and then I choose all of them all the files in this folder okay and click on open and upload okay so we can see under this subfolder sas base codes i have all the sas codes for this sas base course okay